Da 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 da. It's day nine, and it's time to figure out how the heck this deck even functions. I heard that there was a spell mage after hovering over this card manufacturing error, and it said, draw three cards. If your deck has no minions, they cost three less. And I said to myself, I hate minions. I think minions are the enemy of fun. So someone said, well, why don't you play spell mage? And I said, what's spell mage? As has been established, if you've been watching these videos recently, this is my first week back in Hearthstone since 2018. And so I'm just gonna be doing the fun stuff. So uh, this spell mage list has basically spells, uh, some sort of expected things like star power, deal five damage to a random enemy minion, repeat this with one less damage. I guess that this is a better flame strike, especially if you are as lucky as me. Um, some other things like flame geyser for some early removal, lots of discover a spell. Um, where is it? Discover a spell, discover a secret, discover a spell, discover a spell, discover a spell, summon a copy, discover a three cost minion, deal damage, draw some cards and they cost less. Draw some cards and they cost less. For each spell, school cast, I'm gonna four or five vortex, cast five random spells. So it's almost like a discover spell mage. The thing is though, I just saw that this card was recently nerfed or not nerf, the cost was reduced. And I love water elementals, so I kind of want to just run this card. I'll probably just remove spot the difference because I can deal damage and summon the thing at the same time. I don't know if this card sucks or not, but I really, 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 really extremely badly want to run this card. This, this card does seem... This card does um, seem like it's, it's, quite, it's quite good. But, um, I don't know. I'm going to first just run the video game. I'm going to go click Hearthstone. Move Soul Freeze, maybe. Soul Freeze, I believe, is the one mana freeze three things sort of card. I, I'll be honest. I, I, I mean, I'm biased because I have played a lot of different card games. But one mana utility spells, I think, are just generally excellent. Jaina versus the Lich King. The Lich King. The past is dead. Discovery of magic. Alright, this is the game. All right. Discover a spell. All right, what's the most awesome spell? Oh, of course, Yogg in a box. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Runs out on me. My internet lagging, or is it my brain that's lagging? <laughs> Dude, I'm ready. I'm excited. It's Yogg in a box. Yogg in a box, girl. All right, after you cast Spell Summon an Elemental. You can discover a secret instead of doing this first. Okay, I'm gonna do Explosive Runes. Cause, I mean, I don't, I don't see anything from the villain yet. Getting frame drops, right? Yep. Yeah, my internet did blip for a quick second there, but it appears to have stabilized. Electro says, but day nine, can you randomly generate larger and larger men? Uh, what I can do is make myself become larger and larger, which I assume counts in your eyes. So, all right, it's time to do one of my favorite things, which is secret, shoot, and pass. <laughs> oh my god, nuclear bomba. 
going on, Nuclear Bomba? One more Thanks for the 10 gifted hurt. subs. Okay, bye-bye. Alright, what did I shoot? After friendly undead dies, draw a card. Very well. So we're getting into star power range. Dude, this this deck already feels so up my freaking alley. Funky Panda Go says, she said, Dan, I'm playing Hearthstone. Well, that takes me back. Welcome back to your childhood, my friend. My child. Shuffle all three plagues. Opponent's deck. Plagues they draw this game are unending. All right. So, I can just do this to immediately summon some stuff. I, I value tempo plays a lot more right now. Why no deck tracker? Because I'm not a coward, SPDB. How embarrassing. Like, have a deck tracker in a game like this? My god. I mean, listen, listen, I understand the deck trackers are valuable, but, like, what what am I tracking? Huh? What am I going to... Dude, what is with the lights in this house today? Are you guys seeing this? Are you seeing the lights flicker? Like, startling me, man. You seem like my lights. Yeah, no, I mean, I'm a little worried about the electrical signal here. It's hot. It's hot in this place. But also track your spell schools and such. Yeah, I'm not worried about that. Discover a weapon. Spend some corpses. Can you pet the kitty? Yeah, sure. Of course you got it. Nuclear bomba. Hi. Hi, princess. Oh, we're purring. Oh, we love getting patted. After your hero attacks, shuffle a random plague into your opponent's deck. All right. Spot the difference. I think I'm gonna do this. Now, if I, I, I I'm, I'm quite certain that if I do this, it'll summon a zero zero. Well, if this were Magic: The Gathering, it'll summon a zero zero. My opponent appears to be plaguing me. I need to up the tempo. Yeah, Hearthstone does tend to be pretty generous about that. Because in Magic the Gathering, everything, it just summons a 0-0 zero, zero and is like, eat shit. <laughs> it's just like, yeah, no, it's just, that's just stuff that sucks, for sure. Draw two cards, cost one less for each different spell. Okay. So I think it's time to do... Spot the difference. Played an elemental last turn. Discover any elemental from the past. Access denied. Uh, excavate, quick draw, trade one legendary. No. Why not do the paparazzi, huh? Excuse me, over here. That didn't battle cry. Oh my god. Job's done. Out on me. Oh, dude, this is so cool. Dude, that was awesome. Dude, Hangman's Moose, thanks for the 20 gifted subs. Welcome back to our Thursday of Hearthstoning. End of the battlefield is not equal to battle cry. Yeah, T-I-L, indeed. Discover a frost room card. All right, whatever that means. Ow. Nuclear bonus is in bow. By the way, thank you for playing that uh, Tentacle Rogue recently. It's a janky, not good, very, very bad deck, but it's the most fun I've had in Hearthstone in years, dude. It's it was 
So fun. So something has increased the cost of my stuff. I don't know why it costs more, but it does. Where, where do I see this? Legs, man. Lost one more. Okay. Oh. Nuva! 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 Okay. Yeah, I'm just gonna like literally get more pressure on the board. Lifesteal is very good for me here. I'm very pleased to see that. Summon a copy of a minion. Each one dies after taking damage. I don't I don't quite understand what that means. I wonder. All right. Onto that one. Power. Dude, Ariaps says, love seeing you back on your OG games. Welcome back. Well, let's not forget that indeed we're gonna be doing Blizzard games all month long. Oh yeah. And in fact, next week we're doing StarCraft 1 and StarCraft 2. And you can even see on the schedule. Doing some World of Warcraft the week after. I know it says Curse of the Golden Idol Day 2. We're also doing Curse of the Golden Idol Day 3 after that. Book Van Tooks is even Warcraft 2. I I was not going to do Warcraft 3, but the instant I heard this music, that bum bum bum, da 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 da, and I was like, dude. Raise it to five corpses? And serve your king. And serve your king. Gonna troll Artosis at any point. It's gonna be hard, because I'll be honest, Artosis and my brother, Tasteless, are like very clearly substantially better currently at Brood War than I am currently at Brood War. So I would just get smacked if I played against them. But I'm considering if, if my sleep schedules and mixed sleep schedules align, because my brother lives 16 hours ahead of me. Um one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, fourteen. I mean, that's, that's actually pretty close. Maybe if I can discover a spell. Don't think I'm not going for it. There it is. Oh my god, yes! Hell yeah. 500 wins. <laughs> so, what I assume is happening is that I've had 500 wins unlocked for all the classes, but it doesn't give it to me until I win again. Because this is like, this just keeps happening. Kalik Goss. Alright, I'm doing it. I mean, I gotta do it. I gotta do it. Oh yeah, but um, um, if if I have the opportunity, I'm thinking of doing some two v twos with my brother. Cause let me tell you, playing playing Zerg in two v two is it is just not. There's not a lot of complexity. Hopping into it. Jaina versus the ball is off. You were mana battles? Yeah, no, I, I, someone brought that up, and I was like, yeah, yeah, that seems really good. It. It's my yog in a box. 
Yaga in a box. Girl, can you do a kickflip for us? I mean, with the pen, watch this. There you go, there's your kickflip. Oh, we got it, we actually got it on the end. I normally screw that up. Discover a spell, tradable, convert a friendly divine shield. Whoa, that's wild. Oh, I gotta do this. What is this wacky card? Have you seen Death Knight today? Dude, Lord help me. I, I've spent almost 200 bucks on this game, and I'm out of stuff to dust. I'm like, I'm like, out. I'm like, I can't make any more decks. What does Zerg do in Brood War 2v2? One base, Zergling straight into Muta. Friendly minions from a giant with its stats and a rush. Interesting. That's so funny. I'm gonna do this 100%. I mean, I'm, I'm literally going to sprint to this. This is hilarious. Charge! Job done. Burst bird, man. Four mana, seven, seven burst bird. Are you kidding me? Turn down that racket! Doesn't bother me. Freeze this Tarky. Discover and play a movement. Dude, what what is with these lights flickering? Like this is this is like actually alarming to me. Why is this guy so huge now? Alright, hey, watch this. Damn it. Rats. Crap. Crud. I really like spells like that. I think they're a lot of fun. Don't reckon I'm curious if there's a reason why Day9 is trying a classic WoW before retail. Yeah, I'm just curious what it was like. I mean, I mean, it's really, there is very little rich evaluation going on. Because, I mean, they're, the, the two modes are essentially indistinguishable to me. I mean, like, I, I don't know anything. Holy shit, I miscounted a thing. Whoopsie daisies. Alright. Dude, this bring bum ba dum. I mean, that's a nightmare. Bring dun dun dun. I gotta found where I chucked my good pen. I have a whole bag of this pen. Ah, got it. Oh, I flung it somewhere. All right, my opponent's doing stuff, but it just doesn't matter to me at all. Oh my God, yeah, this, that. Oh my God, yeah. Look at this, the value, the circus of value happening right now. Nuclear Bomba says, why have you never dabbled in pool slash bikini streams? Day nine, you seem to have the proper physique for it. I would do a really good job with that shit. I agree with you. Uh-oh. It's a yog in the box. Yog in a box, babe. 
It's my yog in a box. Hoo-hoo. Job's done. Okay, two useless spells. Great. There you go. You're kidding me. <laughs> Alright, it's a good thing I had that thing to Otherwise, it would have been an uh, absolute bust. This is peak Hearthstone. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 Oh, God. Oh, God. Gets two useless draws, though. That's right. Take that. Z Sakura, by the way. You don't have to be so surprised that my viewer count is what it is that I... just don't have to be. Yeah, it's, it's looking a little bit like death. Alright. Locked out of my deal 10 damage spell. That kind of sucks. <laughs> Draw a card, you turkey. Masker girl, let's go. All right. That many with life steals is good for us. If I can if I can commence the attack. This is so awesome. That's so sweet. Oh dude, that's so rad. So this to send all so I think I think that's the sweep so let's see here hmm. I'm just doing the big spell alright seems okay Oh my god, these these are so good. This is only the beginning. This is only oh. swear to god, this is only the beginning. Alright, shoot this turkey. Okay, so so for fun, recast a random spell of each cost you'd cast this game. Why not? Gain a mana crystal. Deal one damage. Discover a spell. Discover four costs at its cost. Deal three damage and... Gotcha. Draw two cards. Each one costs one less. Summon some of these turkeys. Catch five random spells. Game. These guys have rush, right? So I would do. <laughs> this is the game. I mean, we 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 might very well still lose, to be honest. Oh, did I just lose instantly? <laughs> Discover a thing that kills you. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Woohoo! Alright. Oh, very nice. Okay, so deal three damage to a character. 
and we summon water elementals. Do you remember when I put this in? Do you remember when I put this card in? I put that card in. My god, I don't know if you... You may have nodded off for a moment there, but I won 500 games since the last win. <laughs> I've been... It's been a long session, but, you know, the economy's in a bit of a tough spot, so I just figured I would stream 500 wins in a row. Incredible. This is a catastrophically confusing rating system. I don't, I have no idea what's happening. I literally feel like they have a D20 and they roll it. Whatever number it shows, they put a character's face on it and they go, you're 10 and a dwarf. I'm like, all right, and I lose a game. It's like, now you're three and a chicken. Very well. Very well, developers. That is a gnome, sir. Oh, <laughs> uh, well. Tough shit. Tough shit. Grasping a th thousandth win is a major. I'm sure I have more than a thousand with the major one. Come, embrace the chaos. You ask Embrace the it. chaos. Oh, you have no idea, Iroko. This is the game. Void scripture. Dude, on the potential. Happy 130 months in a row. How you doing, Omnipotential? Oh, one of these fuckos. All right. Well, I mean, I, I would prefer not to, but I think it's just important to blast off. Belhan says, do you enjoy this or Battlegrounds more? I would say almost certainly this. Almost certainly. Long. <laughs> yeah. is owning. Yeah. Oh, manufacturing here. Very well. Do this. TVK papers. By the way, Day 9, you can easily make more decks. All your cards in the wild format can be disenchanted. Yeah, I don't really want to dust all that shit. I mean, that, that feels like so extreme. <laughs> it's like the most extreme things I've ever heard. Summon a copy of a man. I, this, this card I still don't quite understand. Discover a spell if you have enough mana to play it. This is actually pretty helpful, this ice barrier. Especially against the warrior that's trying to hit me with the mbops. Let me hear you make some noise! noise! Do you have this in a bigger size? Can you put this apple on your head? Yeah, I mean, I'm going to shoot like this. Ooh, Lifebinder's Gift actually seems pretty, pretty stupid for me. So let's see, next turn I'm going to have eight spells. So then I would cast this. Let the pain speak to me. Let the no pain speak to me. So I don't quite have enough mana to do all the stuff that I want to do. So what we're going to do is I'm just going to go like this. Elemental inspiration like that. I see no reason to be shy about it.
yeah, why didn't he play that before Bladestorm? Because my opponent currently is sitting with 10 cards in hand. So if he had played, he just would have burned a bunch of cards. And my understanding of Control Warriors is that they like the cards. That's so funny. Eat or at or never die. Oh my god. Is it my favorite thing? Alright, so we do this. Two. Three. Alright, th this is this is actually legitimately nasty. Yeah, that's about as good as it gets, huh? Miltor Fosses, I think what is missed most about Hearthstone is Day 9 imitating the card voices. Put this apple on your head. Two damage to all minions except friendly elementals. All right. So. Discover a spell. Sure. Sure. Uh, Maz of V, I would encourage you when you return from the timeout to just kindly listen and respect what we're requesting of you. I understand that in your initial communications you may not have had any ill intent, you may not have meant anything bad or mean by it, and I'm not concerned about that. I'm going to assume that you meant pleasantly and thoughtfully and all these kinds of things. Regardless, I still request uh -huh, that when you come back, It's helpful if you have thoughts about the game to say, I would do this, I like doing this, I would do this, these kinds of things. That is a much more helpful way to communicate, and I think honestly will help you make your points more clearly and more cleanly than railing against our opponent and that sort of thing. Alright, so let's let's do Yogg in a box for four. Fuck. Oh, that's funny. So... Bop. Bop. Dargoon says, hey, Dana, what do you think of Hearthstone nowadays? Which is back when Ben Brode was around. So I think it's it's a bit of an apples and oranges comparison. Um, because I played like thousands of hours of Hearthstone back then. And I've played this new Hearthstone for... Five? No. Seven. So, you know, when, when those are the numbers that I'm dealing with. Seven, seven. So I think I want to be able to punch through here.
Is there a way to do this cleanly? Not especially, so I guess I'll do it in a little bit of a suboptimal way, where I hit like this. I then shoot this for two. And then for one. And then hopefully this lets me bop like this and like this. And then I can counterspell and slip this out this turn. Job done. So how does this work? Summon a copy of a minion. Each one dies after taking that. So this does this make me and the enemy fragile? Is that is that right? What did I just counter? I see, I see. The way that I read it was summon a copy of a minion. Each copy dies after taking damage. And in my head I was like, so I suppose there must be something that says like, change each, summon a copy to summon two copies, something like that. So that actually makes a ton of sense. Lose four armor to resummon this. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do some humorous stuff. So... I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna shoot this. Well, I have another way to deal a single point of damage. Do this first. Runs out on me. No, I, I want to do it anyways. Why not? Then watch this. And I get it back. <laughs> Ow. Threat detected. Dispatching battle box. This is so stupid. <laughs> oh my god. All right. I mean, this game has a lot of stuff going on. A lot of stuff. Feels like a slot machine with more steps. Damn right, Onderin. Blizzard is like, yeah, we're nailing the design goal. The <laughs> pain, pain speaks to me. Okay, so. So this seems like a good one to do, huh? Alright, so get this idiot out of the hand. This is an interesting one. And I'm absolutely gonna do this, because that's just that's just for the memes for sure. says, why not play the seven cost spell and flood the board? Uh, I would encourage you, instead of saying why not, just to tell me what your logic is. Because, I mean, I don't know what to do with that. I mean, like, I mean, the, the answer to the, that literal question is that is a play I could have done. That's about it. Left ones is really astounding how consistently everyone always has a full hand of cards at every point in the game. It is, it is insane to me how frequently all these cards exist. I have three cards left. Holy shit! Hmm. 
I'm gonna chuck that. I'm not really gonna get him to mill. Do Sunset Volley first. I have the best fucking aim of all time. My aim is unbelievable. <laughs> I'm so gifted at this fucking game, dude. I don't, I truly don't even believe it myself. Um, so I actually need to pitch some cards. Three mana now? What? I just need to empty my hand. What does this have? Dude, I'm so good. Amuse me with your tales of victory. Amuse me, bemuse me. Goo goo could you? left. You were voice acted for like a game? Dude, Sam Cobra, I'd be the shittiest voice actor of all time. I can sound like me. I can sound like myself and that's about it. That's what I can do. And I can also sound like, put this apple in your head. I can do that. What did I just counter? Safety. Safety goggles. Do a banger goat impression. I would. I would actually would do the best goat of all time. The chapel. Put it on your head. No, my mana. All right. So the last card is the is the ten coster. Is that right? I don't think I burned it. Let's find out if I can find a secret here. Oh, dude, you'll love to see it. Casual four counter spells in a game. Absolutely nothing compared to magic, that's true. Gotcha. My opponent just played out too many cards. One mana left. I don't think this freezes. That one freezes, though. What does this say? There it is. This is the game. All right. Oh my god, it can't be lethal again with this card? Oh my god, putting this card in is some of the highest value shit someone can do. Ten, six, it's just... Oh my god, Tort Delini, is that... Is that the great basis on which all Dota gaming rests himself? Is that Tort Delini? For those of you who don't know, Tort Delini makes guides in Dota 2, where whenever you pick a hero, there's like 400 or so items you can buy in Dota. And if you just hit F4, it will show you Tort Delini's guides on what items to pick and when. And the best way to describe this is that it is as if Every single net decked deck in Hearthstone was made by one person. Anytime there's a patch update, Tortellini spends like a week updating every single thing. It's insane. The end of your turn. Gain armor. Draw a card. Yeah.
Tortellini says, don't remind me. All right, don't remind Tortellini, whatever you do. Path of building guide, Dota. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fairy tale force, draw a battle cry, minion. It costs one less. Dude, every fucking character in this game fucking has infinite cards at all times. Absolutely, I'm gonna get a sunset volley. Are you joking me? Casino is open. Like, I, I actually think having card draw, there's something interesting about card draw, which is that Magic the Gathering, once upon a time, the granddaddy of card games said, you know what? Um, said, you know, drawing cards is so, 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 so fundamental. It's so foundational to playing a card game that we really, oh, I forgot about this thing. We really should not make that. Restricted to just blue. There should be a way in which every different color in Magic has a way to draw cards. So, for instance, blue can just draw cards. Green generally draws cards based upon creatures on the battlefield. Red exiles cards from the top of their library, and they can only play it this turn. So sort of like a burst of card draw. And so on and so on and so on. I literally don't believe it. This card is just banging. An elemental, followed by an elemental, and I'm milling? Ooh, I'm so good! And in this game, it just literally feels like, like cards are just flooding into my hand. Weeks says, hey, Denine, I know you really like Hearthstone music back in the day. What are your thoughts about the current ones? I don't have thoughts that much yet. All right, Massive, I'm going to give you un... Oh, you already got time out of time. How does this work? Let's do time out. How do I how do I time you out? How do I how do I get you out of here? How is that? M-A-Z-I-C. I'm gonna hit you with another 10 minute timeout. Um, again, I want to be clear that hmm. we're not time-outing because we're big, scary, you know, this is, the, we're big day nine over here, right? And anyone who's, <laughs> oh, oh, yes. Oh my God, look at this. Anything it shoots is doing it. Fantastic. Um... As I said before, I don't think that you were saying anything with malice, but I would encourage you not to try to dump on the player that we're playing against. And we also gave very clear descriptions of the kind of communication we think is appropriate. And we, we gave a 10 minute timeout largely to just stop that. So that way I could you know, have a clarification. So that way I'm not clarifying as you're continuing to type and type and type and type and type. Um, We're having ourselves a nice, thoughtful chat. And when you come back and you say, oh, they'll ban you for anything here. You know, I mean, we're, we're, we're honestly pretty calm and generous about this sort of thing. And so I'm gonna give another 10 minute uh, timeout and I would encourage you when you come back not to be so concerned about, oh my God, how are you being attacked? Oh my God, this injustice to you and all these sorts of things. Um, because there's no injustice, there's just a temporary period where I'm clarifying what works in terms of communication in this channel specifically. There you go. I wonder. So if I freeze Titans, does that mean it can't use its ability? Is that right? I freeze it? Alright, so let, let's do this. And this will give me nine cards in hand. Nasty. 
So what does this even do again? Deal 20 damage to another minion. First turn. Oh, wow. Okay. So we can play this for free. Dog in a box. I mean. <laughs> okay. Praise the Og. Shit, that is that's actually hilarious, man. I mean runs out on me. Alright, how do how do I do this? I, I have too many cards. Alright, this will put a burden on villain. Alright. Coin pass. Right. I, I'll knock him dead. Oh, that animation is very fast. That's a slow animation. That animation is taking its time. Oh my god. Play this. Shooting him. <laughs> Nuclear. Nuclear. Bombus. Have you ever thought of rebranding to Skill Nine? I mean, I do. I do have some issue, given how not quite skillful I am playing right now. All right. All right. All right. I mean, I mean, your next battle cry triggers three times, huh? Make sure this guy gets out of there. Praise the Yogg. All right. Yeah! <laughs> oh, fuck. Okay. Dude, yes. <laughs> that is, that's incredible. Oh, dude, you hit clear of Omba. Just gifted 20 subs. Praise Yogg. Now, I clearly can tell that this is gonna hit the enemy shaman in the face. I don't need to be that lucky to figure that out. <laughs> That's incredible. This is one of the best sequences of gaming I think I've produced. Sold his soul to Yogg. Are you kidding me? Before Yogg was even invented, I was screaming at the poker table one time to whatever <laughs> RN Jesus would listen. Alright, looks like something bad's happening here, but that's fine. Dude, 
Dude, Philippe wants to find 89. I just found a YouTube channel by accident. What a oh god, come on. Work with me, Twitch. I I am So what a nice surprise. Will you approach new games so calmly enjoy them your own way? Unlike all the tryhards on the internet is amazing. Currently binging all your day off games. Dude, hell yeah. I love not taking things too seriously. It is my favorite thing. Uh, praise be the Og real fast here. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh God, this game is so fucking stupid. <laughs> Ow, just my face. Oh no, no, something's happening. Why is it happening? No, literally what is going on right now? All right, well, what can you do? Yeah. I will say my favorite day off that I've done is Elden Ring. I think that's my favorite one. You'll hear me re-explain the nature of why I don't want back seating about a thousand times. <laughs> Y'all mind if I praise Yogg real quick? Hey, I just, I would love to say, um, in the name of the... I don't know, cause, cause like here, here's the the Christian, Father, Son, Holy Spirit. What, what's the hand motion for Yog? Do I just like do a tentacle motion over here and a tentacle motion over here, and then just have a huge mouth? Deal one damage. Deal one damage. And then Eye of Chaos. Random ten cost spell. I mean, I don't know if we're gonna live. Ow, 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 ow. What is this turkey? All right. Uh, I mean, this is actually so hilarious to me. I think, I think we may have literally lost the video game. Isn't that astounding? So let's see. I wonder if there is a way that I could do this. Mm. All right. This is this is this is the best I can see. You face Deathwing. Eridar, Lord of the Burning Legion. This can only hit a minion. All right. Next turn, your nature spells cost one less. Rush Bandit. So, I mean, I, I kind of want to cast this. I'm kind of a little, a little frightened. Let me do very calm plays. Five to four. Something like this. Discover this. Oh my god, we have another Yogg in a box? It's so lucky. The dragon and his pet flame elemental. It's just like me and you, baby. Alright. So, we, we can just clear the board. By casting my little star... star... thingy. At the same time, however... Oh, 
No, careful, careful video game. Easy there, easy. Whoa, whoa. Uh, the counter spell I think would be the funniest. Die, insect. <laughs> Fuck, man. All right, what do you want me to do? All right. All right. All right. I'm not afraid. I'm almost out of cards. I always live life on the edge. Reverb is yogged. Oh, that's right. That is how that works. Taunt, oh, death rattle, excavator, treasure. Oh, that's. Oh, that. That literally hoses us, huh? Why does it not get countered? Why does it not get countered? Why does it not get countered? Cast a random 10 cost spell. When your opponent casts a spell, counter it. Oh, because my opponent with a tendril played it. I'm a card game player. It would always, if you think about it, it was actually the fucking tendril. My god. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Fuck. Oh my god. Fuck. Oh my god. Ugh. Let it explode. Dude, let me tell you, that game, this is your first game of watching Hearthstone, you're just like, wait a minute. Why is the, why is, oh. Ping face ends it. I'm not a coward. I stay until the bitter end. And it is bitter, believe me. It's extremely bitter over here. <laughs> Fuck yeah. Get countered, you absolute clown. Ah, oh, shit, you got me. So, in in this game, I just watched things occur. Wow. Now, if I would have, if I could have chosen to done something differently, it would have been like to just randomly have gotten better rolls. So the one man, a little worm, can shoot for ten damage. Yes, and it's not the player shooting for ten damage; it's the worm. <laughs> Roggins, have you drank that entire uh, jug of water today? Indeed. I want to be the most hydrated man on earth. More so than Tom Brady. I, that's, that's actually where I got that quote from. Where he's just like, I, I believe the secret to good health is to not consume anything except 500 liters of water a day. I don't do coffee. I don't have nuts that are too pale. He has just this like list of things that he doesn't do that sound entirely normal, and he's like, and I also try to drink as much water a day as I can. I want to be the most hydrated man on earth. Yeah, literally look it up. Look up most hydrated man on earth. That's the funniest, that's the funniest phrase ever. That's just a weird thing to say. Crash the thunder, deal three damage, cost one less, reach. All right. Time, time runs out on Avenue Caesar 99 says, did you know you can get water poisoning? Yeah, I think it's called drowning uh, in colloquial terms. <laughs> he didn't burn to death. He just got, he just got fire poisoning, you know. <laughs> I smell gold in them there waters. They like gold, gold again in them there waters. All right, well. I guess I'll just hit, hit, say that's it. Shannon Mains says, I wish I could have as much fun as you, Day 9. I'll be, I'll be real with you. It, it takes practice. Because when I was younger, I was just so fucking mad all the time. I was just so mad all the time. Just, God, I don't understand what... Ugh, fucking, ugh, so mad. Discover spell. Ah... 
balls. Uh. Yeah, I just I just be so so upset all the time, just so bummed. God, I was just devastated. Because, I mean, I, it, when I was younger, I kind of had the sensation that if I, like, was not winning all the time at stuff, there was something wrong with me. You know what I mean? Star power. Yeah! Blasted. You know, it, it, it wasn't... It, it, it was... It was well, it, it was a hard loop for me to break, because I wasn't really conscious of it. It was just a sort of thing that was happening under the surface, where I just like, oh my god, I'm like, for instance, I'm losing in StarCraft. I just need to, like, really practice. I need to practice, like, a hundred times the same build order by myself, because I really don't want to suffer that horrible pain of losing again. Oh my gosh. It was almost like I was running away from this imagined sense of I'm a failed person. And so what wound up coming from that... Cards can't cost less than two, huh? What is this guy? Uh... Everybody, vote for the camera! Battle cries don't do that. Okay, okay. I don't know, let's try it, you know, I mean, I may as well. Oh shit, I'm gonna fucking burn a card, aren't I? No, 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 that, cause that comes back, no, no, we're fine, we're fine. I'm sorry, I'm, I, I am struggling to remember when things enter my hand versus start and I end and all that shit. In their waters. It hurt. Oh, I like to draw cards in a game that has too many cards. Um, but yeah, no, when, when I was younger, I just had this sensation of like, I'm running, I'm running, I'm running. The bullet has been loaded. Well, let me just look at star power. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, and then I don't want to do this because I have too many cards in hand. Why not? Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah. Say cheese. Say cheese. And so what 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 wound up happening is I started to just try to brew and practice deliberately ways to actually find joy in games that I normally would not find that joy. Did I just get... Blood Mage Thalnoth! Lightning Bolt! Bam! Lightning Bolt! Bam! Six damage, summon frogs. Lightning bolt, deal seven damage. Pow! Yeah, so it, it just took a lot of practice, but now, now I just enjoy things. Ben Killer says, man, I wish my friend knew how to do that. <laughs> right, so we can win four games, lose one, and he starts to be salty talking about how he's losing games with me. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, th th that makes sense from, like, you know, the perspective of if I lose games, there's something wrong with me. I'm, I'm some kind of failure if I'm losing games. I need to use this more liberally. There's something wrong with me if I'm not winning. And so if you win, nothing happens. It is null information with that kind of mindset. It's 
so I can absolutely imagine. Your friend, you can win 10 games in a row, lose one, and it's just like, oh, well, today's ruined. I thought I was having a good day, but after all those nine wins, I lost that, that then. Now it's just, it doesn't matter anymore. Bear! And also, you know, something to note about the design of Hearthstone, the fact that there is no interaction. On your turn, you do whatever the hell you want. On their turn, you do they do whatever the hell they want, you know? It, it's almost impossible not to wind up with decks like the one that we just saw. They just smack you out of nowhere. Oh, dude, yes. Give me a counter... Counter spell! Yeah! Well, above see if any expectations come back to Hearthstone. Amazing stream as usual, by the way. Oh, you're so sweet. To say as usual to someone who absolutely has produced some dog shit streams. <laughs> don't think I don't know. I'm there at the time. Ugh. Um, so discover a spell. Deal two damage. Hey. Whoa! Whoa! whoa. The Titan's flame shall never die! The Titan's flame shall bing bong bong! you peaked at streaming yet? I would still say my peak, my, the peak stuff that I did was the education and content for StarCraft. That's, that is the work of which I am most proud. I don't really want to just waste this, but I think wasting is. What to do? What to do? the game music or your music this is i would never put this on in my free time yeah dude that's light it just bothered my eyeballs my opponent's name is easy game they have no idea how easy the game's about to be god honey whenever i'm too tired this just gets me going in the morning God, don't you just feel ready to take on the world? Do three damage to a character. Ow! All right, we did that. Get eight. Jesus. All right. Praise be Yog. Here's the problem. I am gonna mill my ten mana card. I don't know if you know this, but I like have a special connection with RNG. And it's gonna happen. It sucks. Sanitar. Oh, discovery man. Oh, it's so fucking sick. All right. Bang. Hey, this is awesome. This is bad. Why is this the music that's happening? Well, because I want you to know that they decorated this Hearthstone board to look like the room of every Hearthstone player. See, my paints and my crayons are down in my art corner. I have books that haven't been opened next to my stuffed animal in my Rubik's Cube. I am not a man. Did I play the Rush one? Oh, whoops. Oh my god, whoops. One, two, three. How? Does this freeze a minion? All right. 
<laughs> sure you don't have to have some sort of chocolate factory in your house, do you? No, but if I did, I would use it to torture children that were dicks. Let's go, Wonka. Wind Fury, Battle Cry, deal four damage. I mean, that's actually, this is actually a huge fucking problem. This, this cooks us, doesn't it? Well. Uh, discover a secret. Mm, I think I'll probably just go ahead and play the Yog in a Box. Do something that freezes. That was the easiest thing I've ever done in my life. Some way to continuously freeze my Amuse bone. Me with your tales of victory. Seriously, I'm a big fan of amusement. So far, so good. <laughs> and it was fragile, so it just died. <laughs> I've done that so many times. Oh, Easy Game is the character's name. Dude, you know this person was like, Easy Game, and just played it, and then it just like stopped, and they're like, oh, oh, oh. Ooh, oh my god, that is actually so funny. Holy shit. Okay, so we want to do it in this order. One, two, yeah. So this is the one. Perfect. That's a lot of lifesteal minions. Don't, don't. So we chill like this. Because now we can actually threaten lethal. Alright. I mean, I'll still heal from this, yeah? So. Heal. Heal, heal. Fantastic. Truly fantastic. Get out of here. Okay, so we just draw first. I mean, that's literally perfect.
This deck is extremely fun. This is extremely fun. This music. Dr. Angus says this music is too funny and too perfect for this game. I know, right? Oh, yeah, I can absolutely give tummy tummy rubs. There you go. There you go, little baby cat. Forge this, and then I'm going to do this, and I'm going to do damage to everyone based on every single thing that I have. This guy has damage aiming as good as I do. Do you have this in a bigger size? So if your armor changed this turn, draw two cards. I mean, that's just an insane amount of damage. So this right now is 16 total damage. This is 24 total health. 24 minus 16 is 8 minus 2. That's lead. That feels good. Oh! I didn't mean to frighten you. Let's do the tummy rubs. 15,000 wins. You have these, they hop into a chest. You have quick draw cards. Man, there is just too much shit coming up on my screen. I know that like the mobile research shows that people love that stuff, but like I just, there comes a point where I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. Rub them out. Does anyone know, does anyone know where the line rub them out comes from? Does anyone know where the line rub them out comes from? It's you not for it. from your search history. Don't worry about it. Oh, Cyberwolf, K9, getting it in one. Yep, King's Quest. King's Quest 5. Rub him out. <laughs> Leonic said Tree Watch this vlog this week. Yep. That's that's one of my, that's one of the best playthroughs that I've ever done. Especially the <laughs> Sir Grey Wolf. Or had this very like kind of rumbly voice. <laughs> it's just he's like trying to be a tough wolf character and he just sounds like a like a creepy goblin. <laughs> King Alex King Graham, huh? Uh. Wasn't King's Quest predecessor of Here's My Magic? I think it may have been the predecessor to Might and Magic, which was the sort of traditional adventure style games that later became um, the strategy version of Here's My Magic. Quash HS says, would you agree that the snapping mechanic from Marvel Snap would make most card games more interesting on a competitive level? I would disagree with that statement um, in its most extreme you know, take, which would be like, it's literally better. Uh, and, and the reason I would say that is that one of the things that is very nice about a game of Hearthstone is that it goes towards resolution. And I think games that approach a resolution with high frequency are on average more satisfying than games where you are effectively folding a lot. For instance, poker, when there's not money on the line, is just a catastrophically boring game. I mean, it's, it hurts how boring that shit is. And I mean, there, there's interesting aspects, certainly, but like... You just do this and discover something. All right. Fling da dang. So I think that um, Marvel Snap, the snap mechanic, works because games are like a, like three minutes long or less. Oh snap! How does this guy have a seven cost seven? How the what? How is this here? How does this exactly work? Extremely tight. 
Oh, snap. What? What in tarnation? This is malarkey, I see. See it now. Right, we found a good use case for this, this card here. Not worried I got Yogg. This deck is extremely fun. Literally, there is no escape. <laughs> okay, so how might we want to do this? What? Dude. So here's here's what we could do. So this has summon two from the twisting nether, future demons. Alright. Like we could do we could do void scripture and just see what happens. Because we're not actually gonna take that much damage. We could wait to yog a turn. I, I actually think I like that a little bit. This one? I don't know if some of you have just never watched my content before, but that's literally how I always oh, operate. <laughs> ha ha ha. Discover a main from your deck, so a tentacle. Yeah, like, I didn't even question. Did you see, I didn't even, I didn't even have a hopeful tone in my voice. It's like when you put a quarter in the vending machine and the, you know, the drink comes out. It's it's that straightforward. Okay. You got me. So something is messing with me. So I'm dead, huh? So that's So that's the video game, huh? Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. I think we're dead. So if we glyph and we get a freeze, that Not could let do. us live one Not more turn. Do. Not quite. Is this a bug? Lothab. Oh, it costs two less. I see. I see. You know what? We've been winning too much. It's fair. When we're getting a playthrough of Cookie Clicker. Dude, you couldn't pay me a million dollars to play that game. Just play a 12 mana spell. Easy. I'm trying. I'm trying as hard as I can. Let me play my two mana coin. Oh, no! I, I love being lucky. Jane, a ran it all. Leave me alone. How does I think this is my first game with Demon Hunter? Every turn, though. Yeah. 
Just go, says, what would you say if I told you that Drew was able to get up to 20 mana? I would howl with laughter and introduce you to the primeval titan. Oh, you think going to 20 mana sounds good, huh? <laughs> you fool! Why not? Draw a demon reduces cost by two. Very well. Demon appears to be like an aggro class. Huh? Simple delays, huh? Bam! Playing a 3-mana 6-5 next turn. How pathetic. Looks like someone in my chat loves lying. Alright, the double attack. I like this card. You got to Drew's demons? Like, I don't know. I, don't, I, I have no idea. Shinros, is there, is there an aspect you miss about streaming or content creation from 10 years ago that no longer exists? That's a good question. Hide behind you, servants. I will still find you. I think the biggest one is that there's a much um, more diffused and weaker sense of community that exists. Pain, Sun Fury. So, how do I want to do this? I don't think I'm ever going to need to cast that. I, wonder. I mean, come on. Let's gamble. Is that one? That's fine. That's fine. That's terrible for us. That's fine. That's fine. Hey, not bad at all. Tempo 9 TV. Yeah, like, for instance, in the Age of Empires 2 community that, that I've had the delight of learning me. more about, all the players know each other, people in one stream chat go to the other stream I chat, and it's a sense, it's, it's a rich sense of everyone is part of a thing. And when I started streaming, uh, uh, StarCraft II hadn't released yet, so I was part of the StarCraft I community. And, like, everyone knew each other, everyone visited the same locations, everyone saw the same events, everyone was talking about the same tournament finals coming up, and so on and so on and so on. So, um, nowadays, it feels a lot like there is an emphasis, just kind of by virtue of how the monetization works and how many different games and trends are rising and falling, there's a lot of emphasis on people becoming individuals. And I think that there's some incredible content creation groups like say Offline TV, where it's a bunch of friends that regularly do things with each other that like do collaborations in different pairs or as groups, also do some of their own individual streaming that I think is the modern form of kind of creating deliberately a sense of community. And I, I, I really like that and I really miss that, you know. Like, I don't really do a lot of collabs because I just have so much shit going on outside of my streaming. And to create that sort of community of, like, different streamers and viewers that are moving from stream to stream. The past is dead. You asked for it. So I think that's something that I do, I do miss a good bit. I don't know how to value this card. Okay, so this is an aggro turkey, so I should just be ready to zap the turkey. 
Yeah, and I mean, like, frankly, part of the reason that I feel that loss of community is fucking COVID, dude. like feeling my cat to make sure she's okay. I had to take CC to the emergency vet. So I was just I'm still a little like pet stressed, you know. All right. First turn you don't play a spell, huh? Okay, I think she's okay. You have earned an eternity of torment. That feels good. Probably gonna do soul freeze next turn. That should be that should be quite good. Yeah, I, I kind of think that like before COVID, I actually did have a sense of a little bit of community stuff, and it was just really nice, like pre-COVID, to like go to GDC and then PAX and E3 and BlizzCon and TwitchCon, and I'd sort of see the same thing again and again and again. It was just great. Serve your king. Bang. Bang. Boom. Pop. So let's do this one first. I think Ice Bearer seems good against an aggro player. Definitely this. Definitely this. Probably this. So now I'll get to play this for six next turn. Isn't E3 dead? Yeah, no, it's literally dead. It is canceled, it is dead and gone, it has gone poof. One more death can't Friendly rise. undead dies, draw a card. Oh, we're, we're about to hit him with the inbops. Dude, there's so much card draw in this game. I mean, this is this is an insane amount of cards. I'm almost not used to this idea at all. So this has rush. Balls are tired. They're not feeling great. Discover a weapon. Dude, if only I still had freezes gone like crazy. Alright. Alright. There's nothing to do on my turn. Perfect. 
Oh, that's right. I do need to update that. Okay. Alright, yep. What happened? What happened on this turn? Why am I losing so hard? Probably something like this. About the best I can do. Coin for the content. I know. All right, nice. Eighteen. I mean, I, it does feel like I can still get burst down here. Discover a frost rune. Still, I still know what any of those words mean. So let me. Yeah. All right, so. Five health? All right. Okay. Discover a spell. Nice. Discover a secret. Sure. All right. Nice. Please kill that. Great. Still 10 damage. how I do it, baby. So my opponent should know about this one. This one is very funny, though, because if this lives, I now have a couple 12-12s. But if, like, this is the one that lives because this one was getting killed, then I have repeated freeze. Nice. Holy Holy, that's an insane, insane play from Bill in this game is insane! What the fuck, man? Do this, do this. Oh my god! Gotcha. Die at the end of the turn. I mean, I'm gonna do this shit for sure. Return an enemy minion to your hand. Give me that. Gain three empty mana crystals. Deal three damage to all minions. Deal five damage to a random minion. Oh shit. That's not good. That's not good. That's fine. That's okay. That's that's great. Okay. One more death can't Dude, just a card, true heart. Oh my god. Queen. Oh my god. I love just a card, true heart. Oh my god. It's so awesome. Give me an improved hero power, damn it. Wah, wah. 
Someone none did give poisonous. We're kidding. We're doing this again. Oh my god! And so your Jeez, Louise, the video game is killing me. How lucky is Day9 TV? Lucky. I mean, I, I do feel relatively close to dead. I mean, if my opponent can deal damage to me, which seems, seems like it's highly likely. Oh, that's right, this has charge. <laughs> okay. Damn. Damn. I'm not sure what we could have done differently outside of not having minions that ran straight into that poison. Real Bonfire says, as an OG Hearthstone player, what the fuck is happening? Right? Oh my god, it is the licking battery of card games right now. Oh, Charge is dead. Got the kitty more? Oh, sure. What are you doing, sweetheart? You having a nice time? Jane versus yeah, here, you know what? The audience at home would love to You're hear from you. Dead. You just don't know it yet. Be. You ask oh, that's my princess. Yes. You doing okay? Yeah, there you go. Hey, you like that? Despie is so sweet. Oh, we're very happy here, huh? Hey, Despie, you doing good? She's she's going. Brr. Discover a two cost card. Not on my watch. I face wheel of death warlock. I have not. Okay. God, that's so cool. Okay, here it is. We're gonna do Grace of the High Father. Right here. Discover an eight cost Yog in a box. I know better. I know better. Ragnaros is the one that I want to run because he is, he and I go way back. This is funny because Rag is like the one card that hasn't been touched after all these years. It's so good. Ragnaros is just a fun, fun card. It feels like the kind of RNG that I think almost everyone liked. You're going crazy. Die, insect. Oh my god, my soul. It's so green. Oh my god, all the... <sighs> the long
long weeks are catching up to me. What is the highest awesomeness play? I think it's this. Let's try to get. We're just doing things that are high value. I think that the Void Scripture is actually quite good if I can play it late. Oh yeah, what is Raynad up to these days? My understanding is that Raynad is working on a game called the Bazaar. So I think I have multiple opportunities to get a removal spell. What? Alright, I mean, I guess this. Why did that not go off? Oh! I see. I'm, I'm now seeing how this how this video game even functions. Excellent. Yeah, like, my, my, my understanding of Raynad's work on the game is he's just gone through a couple of iterations on it. No way, really. It's my yog in a box. I mean, this this may cost us the game, but I really don't care. Wow. Oh, shit. This one would like a copy that has Rush. Alright. Giving away Hearthstone beta keys? You know, part of me was just like, my brain broke for a moment, because Hearthstone's free and it's out and you can all get it. I just couldn't figure out. <laughs> you just warlocked him? Yeah, no, my opponent wishes they could be this strong. Oh my god, they're all dying. It's electrifying. Oh my god, look at the end for one. Oh, before the ear here. Alright, Death Rattle summons some knights with taunt. Well. When in doubt, yog him out. You're literally shitting me. This cannot be physically possible that I am this lucky. That is, it is unbelievable that I am this lucky. That's the best Yogg of all time. I can't believe it. I'm the best player that has lived. I am I'm incredible. I feel like I did tell all of you that I was the luckiest player in town. I think I did tell you this. And some of you are just like, Oh, Hearthstone's a different game. This game has way more randomness in it now. And that means I have an edge. I have an edge that some of you wish that you had. Does this guy still have charge? Oh, dude, Doom Guard, best design card of all time. Well, I will use my counter magic. I will. I mean, I know the right play to do. I, I'll do it. Let's see, it doesn't share the creature type. 
I should actually save this. Now that I've now that I've done all this shit. <laughs> this is so insane. I, I should have used this to shove the face a little bit harder. <laughs> Him. Look, we're both dealing damage to him. My strength is yours. My strength is literally over here. Oh, we can hit the face? No way. Factory assembly bot. Who does this guy do? Huh? A damage split? You haven't heard the last of me. <laughs> you haven't heard the last of me. And then I go into my online features and hit avoid player. I'm just going to keep playing. I can't stop. I won't stop. It's too fun. Oh, is he's Boulder Fist Ogrebot? Mm -hmm. Boulder Fist Humperdinck. Yeah, yeah, you're, you're, dude, I completely agree, Unknown Killer Sim. It's not God tier luck, it's Day 9 tier luck. Deities wish they were Jade this lucky. They, are, they have all these schemes to twist the fates. The fates just work out for me universally. It's incredible. Seems a little suspect right now. Hogsy says, what inspired the Blizzard Month? Bobby Kotick stepping down. We do more Hearthstone after Blizzard Month. So I'm I'm just kind of planning the short term right now, because for me it's I'm going to do Hearthstone this week, and I'm gonna stop streaming in about 90 minutes. And then next week is StarCraft, and the week after that is World of Warcraft, and there's also a bunch of other Blizzard games that I kinda wanna check out. Like Warcraft 2. I might even check out Diablo 4. I don't believe it. You see, did you see the Marvel Overwatch clone, dude? I hope it's good. Overwatch when? When when they when they let me play the game that I purchased originally. Pleased to announce that if you paid sixty bucks for the original Overwatch, you can't play that shit. No, 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 we didn't. We're not. It's not shut down. I've got a friendly minion, Death Rattle, some copy of it. That doesn't work. Absolutely. Yeah, because here's the thing. I actually, Overwatch, the original Overwatch, was like one of the only shooters that I enjoyed firing up every once in a while and just having some fun. Like, Counter-Strike is probably my favorite FPS of all time. And when I play that, it's like, it's like a serious, like, binge session. Like, I go really hard on that for, like, quite some time. I think I'm doing this wrong. I think I should have been... Going more for the face. Okay. Definitely. Definitely. I can't stop strumming. Ah, I'm gonna strum! <laughs> I'm such a child. Oh, that's funny. All right. <laughs> Deploying countermeasures. Oh my god. I'm strumming. Ah! 
<laughs> I hope I'm gonna put this card in every single in every single deck. All of you will never look at this card the same with his little proud I'm strumming. <laughs> Play your tentacles. No! <laughs> no! Take me home. <laughs> what the fuck happened over here? What is this? Why are there so many cute dogs? <laughs> oh, God. All right. Star power, bang, 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 bang. Not bad. I'm strumming. <laughs> Good for you. Yeah, dude, there's a lot of tendrils in this deck. I gotta, I gotta hit him with the tempo. This is going to be my, my gin card. I mean, this is not, this is not actually that good news for us. Oh my god, Jacob Godserve just gifted us five a happy Thursday to you. May you strum well, Jacob Godserve. Ha, <laughs> a child. <laughs> I can't even read what she wrote, Flux Drop. <laughs> sorry, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to giggle on you. Hey, Sweet Pea, how you doing? That's so great to hear. You enjoying having me back? I know I was out of town for eight days. It's been hard. Full. My hand is too full. I don't even know what's happening. What what is this dialogue line? Pretend that your throat is ooze. <laughs> I've ruined my own stream. Alright. You didn't pick up, so I decided to leave this voicemail. I'm gonna strum. <laughs> yeah, y'all in a box. I'm definitely gonna kill this guy. Okay, that one was bad. Okay, that one was really terrible. Yeah! <laughs> Alright, no, not to my own face. Hey! <laughs> hey, I recognize that! Welcome back! <laughs> Well, I mean, but first you don't succeed, yog, yog again. Oh, that's good. Oh, come here, baby. Yeah. Woohoo. Uh, and we're milling. My hand is too full. All right, looks like we're gonna be burning some stuff. I mean, I'm actually feeling like this is, this is a little dangerous. What does this guy do? Tradable. Battlecry. Someone won a copy of his menu. Trade upgrade. <laughs> uh, 
Oh my god. Oh, look, villain's trying to clear the board. Villain's got fear. We did it. You deal just a couple damage, a little bit at a time, and there you go. Now what? Now. Frogs. Too many cards. Oh, that's such a good one to mill. So I want to do the eight cost. Because we don't have any threes, we have a couple twos. Don't. Yeah, I actually need an emptier hand. Oh my god, I love this. Taunt up to summon each other minion you've played this game that did not start in your deck. What is my luck? Oh my god! Oh my god, nuclear bomba. I don't know what we did to deserve your good graces this game, but thanks for the thousand bits. Dude, this frog is coming back. Hey look, it's how I looked after the pandemic. Welcome, there's two of me. Is this you? And this is me, we're hanging out together? Slower. Slower. Deal 10 damage. Slower. Do it. Do small. Do it. Slow. I'm over here now. Hold on to your glow sticks! Oh, hold on to your glow sticks, everybody! Take that. Get out of there. Ooh, galactic projection. That's good. Hold on to your glow sticks. I'm not gonna say- I got another one! That's amazing. That's amazing. I got another one. I'm just too good at this game. I, have I said that there's no such thing as me striving for god tier luck? The gods wish they could strive for day nine tier luck. <laughs> My opponent better not drop their glow stick. <laughs> Fuck. Oh man, this is actually I'm just I'm having the best time. I'm having the very best time. This deck is so much more fun than I ever could have imagined. It's hydration for luck. Yeah, right. Anytime I'm really feeling like destroy your deck. <laughs> I wish I want to I want to play another one. I want to play another game. <laughs> Absolutely fumbled the glow stick. It's almost like they never held the glow stick before in their life. I don't even know how to crack it. <laughs> the metaphors are drifting to a point where people are like, "What?" Oh, that's so good. Jaina versus Uther. All right, this is the last one, then let's play some I Battlegrounds. Bring order. I will bring order. So Void Scriptures, I, I assume, is a late game card. Hidden Objects seems medium. These are all, okay, perfect. This be. Oh, we're doing, we're doing the intense tummy time. We're just a tangle of legs and an exposed tummy. Oh my god, we're doing so many tummy rubs. Oh, we are just a pineapple upside down cat, aren't we? Oh yes, tummy time. Lothland says, I mean, you told a true lies reference that only so many or only so many of us are that old. Yeah, I mean that's one of those lines that just sticks out in my eyes. Sticks out of my mind. That's a movie line that fucking sticks out of my eyes! <laughs> oh my god, did you hear about day nine? Yeah, no, he Watch this movie, and the line was just sticking out of his eyes afterwards. It was horrible. Um, what the fuck am I talking about? Okay, so, um... Accidents, they happen, you know? Accidents, they happen, you know? What? But yeah, 
True Lies. Great movie. One of the lines that sticks out in my head is, uh, for those of you who have not... Okay, let me just back up for a second, okay? True Lies is a 1997 movie directed by James Cameron. This is after he had done the incredible works of Terminator, Terminator 2, Aliens, like essential sci-fi works. He goes on to make a movie that is so unimaginably fucked up. Oh, it was 1994? Oh my God, really? I guess I'll get this one. I mean, this, is, this is definitely a greedy play. It was 1994, thank you for that correction. 1994, and it is the story of how a spy, played by Arnold Schwarzenegger. Rush, excavate, do stuff. This spy, played by Arnold, discovers that his wife is having an affair. This man about loses his damn mind. Draw two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, I mean, he goes, he goes ballistic. And he starts, like, trying to set up, like, fake spy operations for the person his wife is having an affair with. And then midway through the movie, it turns out real terrorists show up. <laughs> and then he actually has to be a spy and save the day. I mean, it, this... Ooh, I don't want any of those. Yes, this. Oh, wait, why did it get cast? Oh, oh, I forgot what card I played. Holy shit, I completely screwed up. Oh my god, I'm gonna throw up. Whoopsie doopsie daisies. What to do? What to do? Oh, that's so bad. Oh god, I don't want this to be the last game. We're in the middle of talking about true lies. Well, we're definitely gonna do a soul freeze here. Yeah, so I mean, like, like the, the movie, the, there's one of these insane scenes where, like, Arnold Schwarzenegger has, like, tricked his wife into, like, coming to a hotel room to strip for someone <laughs> that she believes she has to do it because she's being, like, blackmailed by the government, but it's actually Arnold there to surprise his wife. It's insane. I mean, this movie is unhinged. It is more unhinged than I have been during this entire stream. And... And he has a recording that he's playing of a guy with a strong French accent. Um, <laughs> hold on, let me play this card and try to remember how the game works. Oh, this is terrible. So I guess I do this, but I don't actually have enough room in my hand. Okay, so then I do this and I get... Are we serious right now? All right, I just... I fucking, I just died. Because the probability of us getting the thing, this is not our last game. This is not our last game. So so he's like playing this, he's playing this tape with this guy with a strong French accent. And he, he say that the, the French guy on the, on the tape goes, no, do it doucement. Do it slowly. <laughs> And I remember, like, I was young when I saw this. I saw it, like, in the theater. And I was like, Mom, what's do small? And she's like, she's like, shh, shh. Oh, yeah. We could have won that game. We had that paladin. No, no, no. Terrible. 
Remember when he has to rewind the tape? Yeah, and he drops it. Like, I mean, I, I like, like I rewatched that movie like a few months ago, and I mean, it's. I mean, like, it was, it was so appalling. I would like found myself standing up. It was that stressful. I, I, I was like two beers deep, and I was like standing up, and I was like, "Bro, we gotta turn this thing off. This is fucking unhinged." And she's like, "We gotta finish this to the end, man. We gotta get all the way through." What movie are we talking about? True Lies. True Lies. You should all watch this movie. This movie is the kind of thing that like, it, it loops so far back around to being appalling that it starts to become okay again. Cause you're just like, cause I feel like if some, someone's trying to be generally like, <laughs> and then it, something horrifying happens like, oh my God, that's horrifying. And everyone goes, yeah, yeah, okay. And everyone kind of nods. Like we all agreed that was horrifying, right? Right, right, okay, right. But when it is exclusively that for like 120 minutes, oh my god, it's the greatest movie ever. You gotta see it. What is this creature? Cobalt Miner? Oh, good, we're against the Palin. Great. So I still have the opportunity to prove to all of you that I know what I'm doing. Oh, yeah, Eraser is a great, great movie. Loved Eraser. Oh yeah, no, it, it, it's just so out of control. It's incredible. Roger right, Tarsus Speed, 90 movies. You wanna know what it hasn't aged well? The first Ace Ventura movie? Oh yeah, dude. All that stuff is just, it is aging poorly as we speak. So let's see here. So, I mean, we do have the ability to do some little freeze easies. This is probably the build right here. How do I think I'm actually gonna win this game? Is it coining out spot the difference? I think it is. Your fate cut sharp. Hollow technician, after any minion takes exactly one damage, destroy it. Is yes! Oh, what what are what are some other just insane movies? I mean, I, I watched Poor Things recently. And that movie was also like unhinged, man. That was some good shit. One more coat of paint should do the trick. I'm trying to think of, uh, of some of the more unhinged movies. Oh! Oh, oh, I have a recommendation, my friendos. My lovely, snuggly, bendy friendies. I have a recommendation. Here it comes. Yeah, I think I'm going to do some discovering here. I think that's what we're going to be doing. That'll do. All right. The most unhinged movie I've seen recently that was fresh. Is Barbarian. Don't look it up. It's a horror movie. Don't look it up. Barbarian. That movie is out of control. The cat has rush? No shit, look at that. This cat has rush. That's crazy. Barbarian was excellent. Okay, so we're going to do this now. One, two, yeah, we're gonna do it like this. Uh, this one. Close. Wow. 
See, that one mana card is just good shit, dude. Yeah, that's my unhinged recommendation for all of you gamers. Elon one having fun. I will not forsake. I'm sorry, what? Open your mind to the light. I'm sorry, what? Tarnations happening right now? What is this? Oh my god, what? Holy shit, we lost. I mean, that's it, we're dead. We're super dead. Five and four is nine, nine and nine is 18, and 18 and three is 21. All right, fine. Do it, do it all, Retor. You forgot the sea. And I make them huge, and this one is huge, and then I heal back, and then I target this one, and then I'm huge. Can't I end on a loss? Of course I can. I end on a loss all the time. 